Let's move everybody up. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh. Okay, that was kind of useless, but whatever. Um, just need all you people moving up. Are they building a road yet or what? I could actually use a road between Texcoco and Talatalolco to like uh, Tenochtitlan or Teotihuacan. Also, why do all their cities start with a T? That's interesting to say the least. I wouldn't say weird, just interesting. Anywho, let's uh, come on, Notre Dame. Oh, he's got the Grey Wall now. That's bad news for us. But it's fine. Uh, each city with a garrison increases empire happiness by one and culture by two. So that's actually pretty good since it gives us extra happiness and also extra culture. So that is a good thing for us. Boom. Taking it. And now we are all, you know, up in the in the happiness. Wait, nope. I'm not going to attack him with that. I'm going to... Oh, wait. See, now a uh, walls... Oh, that doesn't actually give us any happiness right now. Um... I'm gonna get another trireme. Oh wait, what? No, fuck! I was still building the Notre Dame. Destroy that chiz. Boom, get out. Get off my land. I mean it. So there we go. And we also got Machu Picchu on the way, so we're gonna get... Oh, why the fuck did I do that? So we're gonna get a lot of money from that as well. So, I don't... Actually, I don't think any of the games I've played so far have actually gone this well. And I'm playing on a higher difficulty, so I don't know how I did it. What? S against Kathmandu? Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Dude, bro. Am I at war with Kathmandu? Hey, listen. Let's make peace. Let's make peace, bitch. There we go. We're making some money. So we got Machu Picchu. That's a good mir a miracle. Why do we keep thinking miracle? Probably because it's pretty much the same thing as a wonder, but not the same thing as a, uh, a real wonder. Um, Colossus gets us more gold. No, you know what? I really don't need any more crazy uh, things like that. What is going on with the boats? How are we on the uh, astronomy? Only one more turn. See, now we can actually build a super boat. So why don't we just... Uh, let's see. Let's make a um, another trireme. Why not? We could do with that. So, you know, I, I'm doing pretty okay. The only thing I keep screwing up on in every game I play is the happiness. I just do not, for the life of me, I just can't figure out how to get my people to become happy. So that's that's something I need to improve. But besides that, I'm doing pretty okay. Like, I'm in first place. But Genghis Khan is catching up to me quite fast. Hey, listen, dude. Yes, yeah, so let's, uh, let's declare war against uh, Genghis Khan. Oh, yes, who actually wants to do this? So, hey, do listen up. Um, shall we declare war against, uh, uh, I don't know, Genghis Khan? I must decline. Well, you're a bit of a bitch. Elizabeth, I could actually use your help. Shall we declare war against Genghis Khan? Well, you're a bitch. Wow, Bismarck is actually losing. I've never seen that happen before. So, gone is the iron that we got from him. I suppose we should start invading now. Even though we're all stuck in this little confined fucking space. That's the only thing I don't like. Okay, just stay there. Shift, enter. Control, enter. Okay, how the fuck do you end a turn again? Just stop. You're, you're ruining my, my game. Stupid knight. You, you're the worst. Next turn, boom, astronomy. Okay, I want you to go to Dublin under attack. Welcome to the Renaissance area. Okay, I don't really care about that. Uh, next. I don't really have any, you know, iron or iron, so steel wouldn't help me that much, but navigation can help me uh, make frigates, um, you know, for, for war purposes. So let's go with that. Uh, you move up. You are like my frontline best friend. Can't do anything else there. Oh, they're building a road over here. Not sure if you guys can see it. If I, maybe if I zoom in, they're building a road probably from um, Teotihuacan to Tlatelolco. Probably going to make like a little route that connects all my cities, which would be super useful, to be honest. Uh, go. Now you, my friend. Oh, they can't actually pillage? Maybe only like people that are on foot can, can pillage. That would sort of make sense. Um, 
But I'm definitely gonna pillage the shit out of his lands. Let that be let that be clear. Uh, just sleep. Just you know, stop moving. Except for you, you need to move the frick up, and you just need to stop doing stuff. And same, stop it. Next turn. Come on, I need the happiness. I need it. Notre Dame. We met another city state. Blah de blah de blah 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 blah. Dublin is at war with Jengi Kane. That's awesome. Good job. Oh, so he got some archers over there. I'm pretty sure he's just got like a lot of points from uh, having a lot of units, but he actually doesn't actually. He didn't. He never actually um, invested that much in science, and now he's kind of screwed. I hope, and maybe he's not, and I'm just like sacrificing my units for nothing. Could be possible. Uh, let's go with a crossbowman because they're pretty awesome. Um, you too, like a crossbow. Oh wait, no, you should make an observatory so I can always keep my uh, science sort of up to date. And I'm gonna keep the boat around here just in case he decides to take it to the seas. When, you know, if, if he does, I'll be I'll be waiting for him. Next turn, oh, here we go. So the city is now attacking our knights. He's got his archers attacking us. We just need everybody to move up into the, the evil lands of the, of the Mongolians. Come on, don't die, knight. You know I need you. Like the the biggest problem we're experiencing right now is our just crappy maneuverability. That's not really you know paying off that much. So I'm gonna try and get everybody up there, but it's not easy. It's not easy at all. Uh, crap. Wait, how about if you go like that? You know, just use the C's. That's probably a lot faster. You need to stop moving. You need to. You can't really do anything, can you? We can't really flank that easily, too. We have to go through this little passage. We shall liberate the city of New Sarai. It's actually excluded from the Great Wall. Just the one city is, like, <laughs> not included. Oh, wait, there's another one. Oh, wait, there's three other ones. He's got so many shitty cities. I don't even understand why he does that. What exactly is the point of having all these cities if they're all, like, super bad? Oh crap, this is bad. No, knight! No! First knight down. Dublin requests units. We got a bandit. Boat shouldn't be too much of a problem. Let's go over there, you know, make it to the land. Come on, people. Step it up. So, let's see. We can have you move up. We can have you... Attacking the city would not be wise from the, uh, from the forests. That's uh, Kuala Lumpur. Okay, just, just delete the unit. It just cost me money from there. Have everybody move up. Everybody. Damn, this is annoying. Okay, just do nothing. Next turn. This might be a very, very costly attack. Just due to the way that our, our cities are all through that little passage. And he can see all of his coming. But like this, I mean, attacking from the, from the water is probably my best bet. Uh, just attacking from a forest tile. I mean, that's just certain to go wrong. Like, we're gonna die. We gotta die. But not anymore. Now we're here. Boom. Boom. Destruction. Take the workers. Take them all. His workers are actually very valuable. Since, like I said, he's got, like, really stunted, um, you know, science -y things going on. So he actually does need his, uh... His workers a lot. What did I? I thought I had more units than this. This is a little underwhelming, to be honest. What is my advisor saying? To crush the Mongolian Empire. English, Germans. I think I saw the only unit the Siamese had. So basically, at this point, we have a, a military that doesn't even you know have to be afraid of anybody in the game. So that's pretty cool. Uh, but uh, the only problem I, I'm experiencing right now, like I said, is. Uh, the fact that we have to attack from over here. We are at such a disadvantage. And New Sarai is actually at a pretty good spot, to be honest. It's not bad at all. It's just ranged attack. Like, that works pretty well. There you go. Take their other worker. And you, you go back to our homeland. Now the crossbow unit I have here. You, my friend, going all the way. Wait. 
Over there. Oh, I still get also culture for killing enemy units. That's what I forgot. So that's why going to war, if you want like a cultural victory, victory can work out quite well, actually. Uh, now let's have a pikeman attack from the... Uh, let's see, go over there. You just go into the water and do your thing. Next up, let's make a caravel. Hell yeah, more boats. We're gonna need bigger boats. Oh, fuck, no. Why did I do that? Next turn, so that <laughs> unit's gonna get attacked from there. That looks gonna suck, but okay. Bash Balik. They have so many cities that are super close to each other, too. They have a giant empire just from having stupid cities. They're all super small, too. Like here, their capital only has level 7. Like, they only have seven, uh, a population of 7, which is super low. My... Here, that's 18. That's... Uh, wow. You are losing. So bad. Except you have... What is that? A legion or something? No, they don't have legions. What is this? Oh, no. they got swordsmen. Is the yes. Sir Washington. I have extra marble. You can have it. That's totally dope. Don't be uh, afraid to... Don't be a stranger or something. I don't know. Hey, do you want money? Boom. There you go. Now give me your, your incense because I need it. Kill them! Kill their swordsmen! Why? Why is this city so good, like, defensive-wise? I don't... That doesn't make sense to me. Grassland. I see no way to, to take this city. Like, it's not gonna work. I'm gonna have to sacrifice so many units. Um... Work boat. So they, you should just invest in, in, in food over here. Like, that's all they should worry about. Floating Garden's pretty good because it gives production as well. So let's go with the food focus. And get everybody over there. Maybe we shouldn't go for New Sarai. Maybe we should go for another city. I'm not quite sure, but... At the same time, if we take this city, we can safely pass through here. So I'm going to have to sacrifice all my units. That's just the way it is. To get somewhere. How did it die, like, immediately when attacking the city? It doesn't make sense at all, but... Okay, that's just the way it is. I'll accept it, if I ha if I must. Okay, now you, my friend, just build improvements, go to your homeland. Wait, what? Costly attack, but not super costly, just kind of costly. Go onto the hill. So now we have a great general, which is really gonna help us in- No, what the fuck are you doing? Are you kidding me? Having a great general is really going to help in attacking the city because it gives you a 15% combat bonus when fighting. And it, you can get even more from that if you have like a really good... Uh, if you have a civilization that gives a bonus for that, which I don't think I do. Oh crap, they have like the uh, Mongolian units over there. Okay, Texcoco has grown, that's a good thing. They kidnapped our worker, but nobody cares about that. They have Kashyyyks over there, which are actually, you know, really good units. So I'm going to try and... I don't know. Let's pillage this first of all. And... I don't know. Workers, get out of there. You guys need to heal up a bit. And then you guys need to land. Um, let's see. You need to... Uh, can we attack from here? No, they can't even attack from here. Let's go into the forest and attack from there. And then I can have these swordsmen land on the beach. Like it's D-Day. And then go like that. Um... This is truly terrible, like, jeez. Wish I had nukes, but I don't. Um, let us make more... No, wait, this is actually not the best city, so let's go with this. Do they even have silver or gold? Oh, they have silver over there, and that gives us two extra gold. Um, or we could go for a castle, workshop, faster production, a university for science. We do have jungle. You know what, let's go with a... I'm not quite sure what I should do. The Colossus is a good one, too. Gives us all the gold. Let's go with the Colossus. Why not? It's a good, you know, wonder. Um, go into the water. You know, it's going to help so much. There you go. Who is this, anyway? Michiel de Ruiter. So, which is a Dutch guy. I'm not sure why I keep getting Dutch people. Because I'm pretty sure I got him in my last, last game as well. Uh, maybe they can, like, the game can smell... What nationality the player is, I'm not sure. Kind of weirded out by that, but it's fine. Oh no, the Kashyyyks. 
They're creeping me out. I hate the Kashyyyk so much. Unit promotion at the best time possible. First go with that, and then promote. And heal all the way. And then you can attack the city for a little costly... Oh, wait. First, what I want to do is shoot the city. Take down their defense, you know, quite a bit. Let's start with that, too. Let's take down the Kashyyyk. Whoa, that's good. Holy crap. Okay. Thanks for that. Now let's have the pikemen move up. Followed by them and them. I don't want to have them take damage from the city, but okay. Uh, there we go. I have everybody here. It's going to take forever having them move up, too. Jeez. Um, Tennis Titlin, let's go with um, some barracks. Then next time we make units, we, they're actually going to have more experience. You know, that's, that could actually help a lot if you have all those combat bonuses. They give you extra stuff. That's actually really useful. Um, now you, my friend, destroy the Kashyyyk. I'm going to try and keep their units away from me. And hopefully I'm sort of, you know, halting their advances when it comes to science and economic stuff. Oh crap, they have some pikemen over there. That's pretty bad. Oh no, not my pikemen. Oh, still alive. <laughs> Joke's on you. My pikemen still alive. Get away, you stupid bandit boat. So annoying. Okay, so we have Michiel the Router again. So let's move him up. And let's attack that. There we go. I uh, approve of that. Except, why aren't they shooting? Shoot! Huh. Boom, boom. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's do it. Why not? Fuck it. Like they're dead, but they can do some damage. Costly attack. Why do they have, like, penalty of attacking over a river? Ah, so that's why... Okay. That makes sense. I'm a bit of a, a dumbass. Um, there we go. Let's move everybody up. Uh, except we can't really move up that much. And I... Attacking over, over a river is, as you can see, a very costly <laughs> thing to do. It will kill your units like nothing. Uh, let's move away with the worker that we captured. And you stay over there. Next turn. Wow, this is going slowly, but surely. I guess you could say. Even though some of my units are getting destroyed, but attacking from over...